snake and the baby ducklings here. Quite a few animals are happy to free range around the zoo and it's actually something that the zoo encourages. They actually would prefer this environment to feel not like a kind of separation between the animal enclosures and us, but trying to get the feeling that this is a habitat in itself. So there's, there's George the peacock, there's, there's a whole bunch of other, the bush turkeys, they all roam free throughout the zoo. We also have ducks and ducklings. It's a beautiful place if you want to live, I suppose, to come in here and stay. Uh, but they're trying to, to break down the barriers that we originally and traditionally have of this idea of uh, a zoo as a place where you come and there's locked in enclosures and that's where the animals are. One of the examples of this is one of the monkey exhibits that we just looked at. I forget the name of the, uh, the monkeys, but they don't swim. So it's an enclosure where you don't have traditional kind of walls. You've got a kind of an island area with some trees that the monkeys live in surrounded by water, recycled moat water and that allows us to feel like we're closer to the to the monkeys and they're actually completely fine and happy where they are uh, because they would normally have that in the wild they just wouldn't go anywhere near the water in fact we're the only primate that likes water and goes in it and swims 